Hello everyone, thank you for checking out this video. You are with Coach Joel from Terry Chew Academy. Right now, we are going to solve this question together. For this lesson, we will be tackling a model method question. Okay, so let's get to the question. So the question states that Jordan has 37 apples and Jonathan has 15 apples. So they are asking how many apples does Jordan at least have to give to Jonathan to make them have a four apple difference, okay? So to know this, okay, when they said Jordan at least have to give how many to Jonathan, right? So because when we look at four apple difference, there is actually two scenarios, okay? One is with one is where Jordan has four more apples, okay? But the other scenario is in which Jonathan has four more apples, okay? But since, okay? So we say that since Jordan has more initially, right? Jordan has more initially, okay? Therefore, Jordan must be the one to have four more apples at the end, okay, instead of Jonathan. Okay, why is that so? Because you want to satisfy the condition of least. Okay, so we know that Jonathan must have four more apples at the end. Okay, so how do we solve this question now? You know that Jonathan has 15 and Jordan has 37. All we have to do is to work out the total apples first. Okay, so the total apples is actually equals to 37, which Jordan has, plus 15, which Jonathan has. Okay, so when you work that out, you'll get a total of 52 apples. Okay, and now, since we know that Jordan must have four more apples rather than Jonathan at the end, Okay, all we got to do now is to simply draw a model. Okay, so how do we draw the model? The model will look something like that. So we have Jordan and Jonathan. Okay, you can draw them to have the same box first. Okay, but Jordan must have four more. So I'm going to draw out a smaller box and I write a four over here. Okay, and we said that the total number of apples must be 52 okay and once you do this now you can actually work out that your two units is equals to 52 minus 4 which is equals to 48 okay and from here you can actually find one unit which is equals to 48 divided by 2 which is equals to 24 Okay, and what this 24 means is actually Jonathan at the end, okay? Jonathan at the end, okay? Which means to say that Jonathan must have 24 more apples at the end, okay? So let's look up here again. Jonathan only has 15 apples to begin with, but Jonathan must have 24 at the end, and therefore... We can actually find out how many apples did Jordan give, okay? Or Jordan must give, okay? So Jordan must give, we simply take Jonathan apples at the end, which is 24, minus his initial apples of 15 over here, okay? And this will give you your answer, which is 9 apples, okay? So your answer is actually equals to nine apples and that is your answer thank you for watching this video i hope you have enjoyed today's lesson goodbye and see you again in another lesson if you would like to learn more from these tutorials please smash that like and subscribe button